So my name's Paul Hitchin, I'm the UK General Sales Manager. I've been with Ashida for, that's coming on for 30 years. Um, I started as a service engineer um, 30 years ago and I've moved into uh, the sales side. Uh, I'm the General Sales Manager, have been the General Sales Manager for three years. More and more customers are looking for a, a one-stop shop. So the, the, the multi-ed wear is actually just a, a piece of the jigsaw. Um, it is a very important piece of the jigsaw, but basically they want to minimise the risk. So when they make a large investment, the risk is managed by a, a single partner who works with them to supply all of the equipment, including the multi-ed wear. That tends to be the, uh, the, 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 the critical area um, that our customers are looking for. Snacks is probably one of our biggest products. So if you take uh, Walkers, for example, they have a lot of our machines. Um, if, you, if you take a smaller, um, we, we, we obviously do a, a lot of business with small startup businesses. It's a little bit different with them. The projects tend to be smaller, but generally our customers' plan is to minimize their risk when they make an investment. Ashida invented the multi-ed wear in 1972 and um, there's all sorts of stories around how it was invented um, but uh, essentially the, uh, there was a, was a requirement for the accurate weighing of peppers and uh, Ashida came up with the idea of using a combination system. So multi-ed wear is, uh, is really a combination system. So it's a, it's a, a system which makes combinations up from all of the heads and selects a series of hoppers to use, which make up a combination which hit the target weight. Um, so really the development came from the combination side of it and also how to feed the product onto the machine because a critical part of malted weighing is on the top of the machine where the, um, where the product is distributed around the machine. That's a critical part of, of multi-head weighing or combination weighing. So, as I said, the, the, the top of the machine is critical. So you've got the, uh, the, the feeders around the, the edge of the machine. Um, the, 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 the benefits that Ashida have over um, other multi-ed weighers is the power of the feeders and the amount of control. The critical part of multi-ed weighers, as I said, is the feed. And if you control that feed, get accurate feed to all of the heads around the machine, then that gives you better accuracy. Um, so there's, there's two parts to it. There's the, the, the feed of the multi-ed wear, the feed of the product, and once you've got accurate feed and controlled feed into the weigh hoppers of the multi-ed wear, then you look at the weighing accuracy. And so Ashida has a huge benefit in the, the, the feed side of it with getting the control using pulse width modulation. And pulse width modulation gives you the control benefit, but also day one performance for life. Um, other multi-ed wears, you have to um, make adjustments to the, the tuning of the vibratory feeders over time, whereas with pulse width, pulse width modulation, you don't need to do that. It's day one performance for life. When you look at the, the weighing side of it, so you have the, uh, the weigh hoppers and all of the software and the control around the, the accurate weighing of the, uh, of the machine, we have various software features. Uh, we have anti-floor vibration, which monitors the amount of vibration in the area, um, and that then um, offsets the vibration against the output of the load cell, which again gives you more accurate weight. So when the product comes out of the bottom of the multi-ed weigher, it's, it's pretty much exactly what, uh, what the multi-ed weigher thinks it is because it's taken all of the outside factors into consideration. Any, any packaging machine, any packing line, is, is, it's a, it's a one-off investment which will give you a return on investment. But that return on investment is, is, is really driven by the, the line running. So if the line's running and you can maintain it and keep it running, obviously that return on investment is realised much sooner. If the line keeps breaking down and there's no support, for example, obviously that line isn't running, therefore you're not getting a return on investment. So you might be able to um, initially invest in cheaper op options for, for weighing and packaging and, and lines, but it's not a long-term solution. It's a very short term, you don't get the backup. Whereas with Ashida, you get a very, very high quality 
machine, whether it be malted weighing, bag making, whatever it is, you get very high quality, but also you get the back, uh, the, the backup as well, the backup support from Shida. And which is really in the food industry, that's, what, uh, that's what's needed. And if you have a breakdown, the, the costs of breakdown are massive in the food industry. Sometimes you could be talking between 10 and 20,000 pounds per hour. So you, so you really do need to have a, a partner who's able to support you. Um, and she to have, in the UK, for example, 25 service engineers spread throughout the country. So we're able to give our customers the, the best support possible to minimize the, up, minimize the downtime, increasing the uptime. If you buy a Shida, you buy it once and it works and it will last for 20 years plus. We have machines going around um, that have been in the marketplace for 30 years. So you'll always get support. We're always here. We've been here for, for many, many years. Um, and that would be my main message, really. For every challenge, there's a Shida.